You can use farm logs to keep a detailed record of your completed and planned activities all in one easy to find place. You can log your activities using farm logs on the web and our mobile apps. Let's start with farm logs on the web. In the menu, click activities. Click add activity. Click to select the activity type. Today we'll log a fertilizing activity. The crop year defaults to the current crop year, but if you're logging an activity for a previous year, select that here. Select the fields on which you want to add the activity. Click here to filter the list of fields by commodity. Or click these checkboxes to select all fields, a group of fields, or to select individual fields. Once you've selected the appropriate fields, click Continue. Activities default to a done status. If you're planning an activity that will be performed in the future, click Mark Planned. Click Choose Date, and then use the calendar to select the date that you performed or plan to perform the activity. Add any other necessary details, such as input, application rate, tractors and implements, and any applicable notes, and then click Log Activity. A complete list of your activities can be found on the Activities page. They're organized by the activity's status, planned or done. From the Activities page, you can hover over a planned activity and then click Mark Done to change the activity status to Done. From here, you can also mark Late Activities Done or Cancel Them. Click on an activity to view its details and edit the activity. If you make changes to an activity, be sure to click Save. You can log individual activities using our mobile apps. In the menu, tap Activities. Tap the Add New Activity button and then choose the activity type. Choose the field, and then add the activity details. When you're done editing, click Save. To edit an activity's status on mobile, tap the activity to view its details, make any desired changes, and then tap Save. 